Oh, welcome back, everybody. I'm glad you guys are joining me today as we dive into the story today, talking about where Trump is leading Biden nationally uh, by four points. And of course, this is huge news because we know the Democrats have been using uh, utilizing every tool in their toolbox in order to prevent Trump from even appearing on ballots across the country. But apparently, the voters across the country want Trump to be on the ballots. And not only that, they want Trump to be the next president in many of these polls that we are seeing come out right now, which also feeds into the fear that Democrats uh, have at Biden not being able to win this next election and their their efforts to dive even deeper into their sh uh, shenanigans in order to prevent that from uh, taking place will be full on display for all of us to see in this upcoming general election cycle. So before we dive into today's video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe button. If you're new here, thanks for joining me. Allow me to share some info with you. Hopefully you can share this info with your friends and family. Smash that like button to 1500 likes. And if you like the content, you like the video, you like the channel, you can smash that join button, become a member of the channel, or you can smash that super thanks as well. All of it's appreciated. So thank you so much for the ongoing support. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we have here today. And of course, we know as they continue to assault uh, Trump at every turn, he continues to grow more and more popular with the electric in this country as they are seeing that, hey, why do they want this guy off the ballot? Hey, why are they trying to put this guy in jail? Hey. That doesn't seem like it's a very fair thing. Why are Democrats trying to do this? The same Democrat party that continues to say democracy, democracy, democracy. But then what they really mean is one party rule, one party rule, one party rule. So let's go ahead and dive into this article coming to us from, of course, the post millennial over here. It says Trump leads Biden by four points nationwide. And what we see here is taking place. A new poll has found, of course, here uh, that the 2024 front runner, Donald Trump is leading Joe Biden nationwide by four points, with former president winning over independent voters as well. The Daily Mail found that the American uh, American likely voters prefer Trump over all candidates at 40 percent. Biden came in second, second with 36 and RFK came in with at 4 percent and Cornell West at 1 percent. 18 percent uh, voters were still on the side. And we know Cornell West was even on the ballot <laughs> in a head to head matchup. Trump. Uh, has widened his lead over Biden, taking a 46% of the support compared to a 43% for Biden. The poll turned in Trump's favor back in September when support flipped to Trump. JL Partners surveyed 984 likely U.S. voters and the poll margin of an error of 3.1 uh, percentage points. The poll was conducted before the Colorado Supreme Court ruling against Trump being on the state ballot. But despite that, JL uh, I partners and co-founder James Johnson said that this may not affect Trump's support at all. Voters might think that Trump is guilty of the charges he is uh, he has put to them to him, including a sizable chunk of Republicans. But his record in his first term means he is still attracting support. Johnson said, "But look closer, and it becomes clear that Trump is leading is more because of Biden's weakness than Trump's strength." So, as we continue to barrel into 2024. And of course, this election year, as it, it's going to heat up, this is going to probably be the hottest election year to date in this nation, right? 2020 was a very hot election. Uh, we may see the, a repeat in 2024 where Democrats will, in the media and the corporations, will do whatever it takes in order to get their guy across the line, whatever it means to destroy the country. It doesn't matter because it's all, the only thing that matters to these people is money and power. Um, and if it means destroying the opposition of the party, then they will do so in every facet, in every way that they're able to. Anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Are you still voting Trump in the primary? Are you voting for him in the general election? Or have you soured on him or you're looking for someone else? Let me know in the comments down below. Of course, you guys can follow me on all my social media, all linked in the description down below. Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Have a great, great day.